the new embed function in the Windows 10 OneNote app has some very special features for student collaboration. If you see in the new app, you will have files button here and a PDF button. Before you do anything else, come over to the three dots in the corner and click on settings, options, and make sure that file attachments options is on. Once that's all there, you are now able to insert a file from anywhere on your computer or if you have the OneDrive syncing tool, you can upload a file from that place as well. So if I click on file, I'll get a file from my desktop called embed. I click open. It says that it's uploading to OneDrive. This takes a few seconds to complete. And now that document is with one click basically embedded in your OneNote page. Because this is a Teams class notebook, if I go to my Teams app and go to the Files tab and then open in SharePoint, you can find where that file has been uploaded to. So if you just go to your documents, which is above your general tab for the team, you will find a new folder called OneNote Uploads. As you can see, all of my OneNote embedded files are now in this folder. If I click on the details information pane to the right, I can manage access and see what student rights are at the moment. As you can see, it defaults to allowing the English members or the students in the team editing rights. If you want them to edit that, then leave it as it is. But if you just want it to be an embed that is read only, just select change to view only. From now on, all of those one-click embeds will just be read-only for downloading or reading on the OneNote page.